Okay, in this video, I just want to give you a quick overview of how um, we want you to navigate our Learn site. So, obviously, if you're watching this, you figured out how to get into this video, so you're already on your way. Um, but let me just talk about how we're going to organize our, the content in the course. So, the main way that I would expect you to find things is coming into this content browser here on the right side and we're going to organize it by time so you can see that right now we've got <clears throat> some things here before I record this video all that's there right now is a link to the survey that we want you to do um, that we're, we've told you about over here in the news section um, and then as we go with each class you can see that we've got some things in there for you for class one and things will be built up. So that's essentially how we're, we're going to do it. You can also get to it by clicking on content and the exact same thing comes here as more of, more of a file thing, but that takes you off the main page. Um, whenever you want to get back to anything uh, and get back to home base, you always just click on course home. That stays there all the time in the navigation bar. Okay, so that's how you're going to find things mostly in the course. The other thing I want to show you quickly is discussion boards. The primary way for you to contact um, and get answers to the questions that you want is going to be through these discussion boards. And so, for say for example, you had a question that you wanted to say, uh, you know, what when do classes start? You need to go in here, and there's nothing in the discussion board about that. So you're going to start a new topic. And the really important thing here is the subject. We want this to be as descriptive as possible. Um, so we could even put the whole question right in there. When do classes start? And then, of course, in this case, the question is going to be redundant, but we can uh, just say put C question, or just let's just type it again. When do classes start? And now, important here, the default is for this to be authored not anonymously meaning your name will be attached to it if you want it to be anonymous you click on that and if you wanted to you could add audio or, or uh, add a file but for now we'll just leave it as a question and then we can see that now when we go to the discussion boards if we go back to home page we can see there's a message there and now other people can come in and reply to that so this is going to be the primary way for you to communicate if you want to be notified every time these things are hit with questions or answers you need to subscribe so you click on the star and then you can choose a frequency do you want it to come immediately or once per day just update you on what's happened on these discussion forums I would recommend immediately I'm sure you guys are very used to getting tons and tons of emails um, so get you immediately make sure that's going to the right email address for you and then click subscribe I'm not going to subscribe this test student but um, okay hopefully that was clear Next thing I want to show you is, um, well, we, let's just look over here in the news section. What we want you to do is, as soon as you can, get a recent picture of yourself. So just take it on, a, on whatever device you can with a webcam. Um, you can see mine, well, you can see uh, Professor Rogozinski and me right there. But we, on, on my uh, homepage, I have a profile picture. So when, to get to this, you go, my home. My picture is not going to show it right here because I'm up in, in here as the test student right now. But there, right now, most of you have this silhouette type thing. You need to go in here, click on profile, and then change picture and upload the picture. Okay, and simple as that. Really like you to do that as soon as possible. Um, you can fill in all this other information if you want, but you don't. It's it's not necessary. The other thing that I'm asking you that we are asking you to do is to um, prepare and send uh, email me a uh, very very short video introducing yourself the most important thing in the so how do you do that well I'm, I'm sure you all know have multiple ways of doing it but um, if you you can do it on, on an iPod or a Blackberry or whatever it is that you have that has a camera anyway just send me the a video and all I want all we want from you is you saying your name so hi my name is John Smith saying it the way using the name you want to be called and uh, and pronouncing it as clear as you can you can tell me other things if you want to but really I just want you to say hi my name is John Smith and 
Um, uh, I'm a third year student, if you want to say something else, but you don't have to say anything else. Just really, really quick video so that I can see you and see you and hear you pronouncing your own name. Um, if you don't, if you want to do that on the computer, you can do it through YouTube. You will need to be signed in to YouTube. I can't Im imagine most of you already have YouTube accounts, but you will need to sign in to do this. Once you sign in, then all you have to do is go to Upload and choose Record from Webcam. Obviously, you need to be on a computer that has a webcam and a, and a microphone. Once you have that, you'll be able to record that and then send me the link to the video, and uh, that will be perfect. Um, so however you can get it to me uh, will be fine with me. Okay, so uh, hopefully that gives you a good sense. These these things I would like you to, you've already, by watching this, you've knocked off number three. The last thing that is important for you to do is go here and vote in this tutorial. Um, as you'll see in the other videos on the, on the site, we uh, are going to run these tutorials online, which means we can do them any time we want. And these are the options that we have available. So just simply rate each one, save, submit, and you're done. Okay, um, hopefully that's all I wanted to get across and look forward to seeing you in a few weeks.